Alrighty, we're back. I'm gonna make my Caesar salad dressing. Uh, cannot divulge the ingredients because some days I might want to bottle this stuff and sell it commercially. Is it that good? I don't know. You'll have to come over for dinner one of these days and find out. Uh, so anyway, I got my stuff in there. Um, just egg yolks and vinegar and a few other things. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn this up and I'll try to talk a little bit louder. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drizzle the oil in here very slowly. And what that's gonna do with the egg yolks is gonna cause the emulsification. It's going to allow the water, the liquid and stuff to combine with the oil and then the, 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 the little cells and the egg yolks will, I forget. Anyway, it's going to emulsify and it's going to turn into like a mayonnaise. So we'll get this going. Um, I'll record it for a few minutes just so you don't, you know, you won't be able to hear me talk probably over the sound of the machine, but you'll see the slow drizzling action and uh, maybe we'll get in there and take a look with the camera. So here we go. <laughs> And you want to start off slow to get the emulsion going and then once it starts to thicken up then you can pour a little bit faster. Pour it on this side. This splashes a little bit. Sometimes what I do is I put a tea towel over the, over the mixer. I've ruined many a t-shirt with grease stains from just by splattering, so maybe that's what we'll do. We'll just pop it over, take my glasses off because I really can't stand dirty glasses, and then we'll crank this puppy up. And then we'll show you when it's all done. Okay, I got about half my oil in there, three egg, egg yolks in there. Usually an egg yolk can hold about 200 mils worth of oil. So we got it in there. Um, let's bring the camera over and take a look. Da -da -da -da. Unlock the mixer. You can see it's a nice consistency. I can keep it in focus here. Try not to get any Caesar dressing on my iPad. It's a, it's a thick like a mayonnaise. It's a thick like a mayonnaise. Eh? That's a nice thing. <laughs> my poor Italian accent. Um, we'll put the camera back relatively in the same spot. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to add some Parmigiani cheese. Um, you can put anchovies in this. I didn't put anchovies in this in this one. About half a cup, a cup or so. Don't forget to take a spoon out when you turn the mixer back on, otherwise stuff might go flying. There we go, we got her mixed. I'll let my sous chef who is Therese come and taste it, make sure the seasoning's okay, and then, uh, yeah, maybe we'll move on to grill the chicken next. All right, outside. It's raining a little bit, but that's okay. My grass is cut short for now. The more rain, the faster it grows. It is what it is. My barbecue. Season up my chicken thighs with salt and pepper. Uh, oil them up so they don't stick to the grill too much. And you just pop them on. When I did the pork chops, somebody complained that they wanted to see the pork chops finished. So I guess I'll have to stick around and videotape this when the chicken thighs are all done. And we'll get these on and get out of the rain. Oh. Okay, guys are done. They're looking pretty cooked. Got some nice grill marks on them. I'm going to slice them up and uh, yeah, wait for the company to show up and dinner is served. Yeehaw! Quiet on the set. Chicken Caesar salad, croutons, macaroni, lettuce, chicken, bacon from this morning, Caesar salad dressing, cheese. We're going to dress her up and get a picture. Whee! Chicken Caesar salad. Whee!